The hand wrist radiographs have been used as gold standard for determination of skeletal maturation for many years. To avoid additional x-ray exposure of a patient, a new method for assessment of skeletal maturity based on the analysis of the morphology of the cervical vertebrae was developed. The first seven vertebrae in the spinal column constitute the cervical spine. The first two, the atlas and the axis are quite unique. The third through the seventh have great similarity. Maturational changes can be observed from birth to full maturity. Vertebral growth takes place from the cartilaginous layer on the superior and inferior surface of each vertebrae. Use of cervical vertebrae for assessing skeletal growth on lateral cephalogram was introduced by Hassel and Farman using six stages. Certain levels of bone development are associated with change in the shape of cervical vertebrae. Stage 1 initiation. It marks the beginning of adolescent growth. Lower borders of C2, C3, and C4 will be flat and wedge-shaped. Superior borders are tapered from posterior to anterior. 80 to 95 percent of pubertal growth remains. Stage 2. Acceleration. In this, acceleration of growth takes place. Concavities are seen in inferior borders of C2 and C3, and the body is rectangular in shape. Inferior border of C4 remains flat. 65 to 85 percent of pubertal growth remains. Stage 3. Transition. There is acceleration of growth to peak height velocity. Marked concavities are seen in inferior borders of C2 and C3, and the body is rectangular in shape. A concavity begins to develop on the inferior border of C4. 25 to 65 percent of growth is left. Stage 4. Deceleration. In this, there is deceleration of adolescent growth spurt. Marked concavities are seen in C2, C3, and C4 in their inferior borders. Shape of C3 and C4 is square. 10 to 25% of pubertal growth remains. Stage 5. Maturation. Final maturation of vertebrae takes place. More accentuated concavities are seen in inferior borders of C2, C3, and C4. C3 and C4 are square in shape. 5 to 10% of pubertal growth remains. Stage 6. Completion. In this stage, adolescent growth is almost complete. More accentuated concavities are seen in inferior borders of C2, C3, and C4. Shape of C3 and C4 is square, with vertical height. 